there are other benefits for this procedure. For example, how well the system will work in selecting out embryos and in achieving pregnancy rates will obviously depend on how good the embryology laboratory is. Hypothetically, if a center has a lousy embryology laboratory, having this closed system may actually help them get better pregnancy rates. So in some programs, it indeed may improve pregnancy chances, but the opposite may be true too. Uh, that, that closed system may not be as good to embryos as a real great embryology laboratory, okay? And I can only tell an anecdotal story here. We are currently in the midst of a study where we are comparing one of these instruments to our standard historically used embryology. And one of our senior embryologists who about a year and a half ago had an IVF baby with us, uh, she decided she wanted to have another baby. And her cycle came around shortly after we got this instrument for the study. And after the first week or two, our embryologists were in love with the instrument, with the beautiful pictures and everything. And our embryologist who had her IVF cycle was begging to be in, in this to, to have her embryos in, in, in this instrument. And we told her we couldn't promise her that uh, because it was a randomized study, she would be randomized. Well, I cut a long story short, she did not get pregnant this time. Actually, she, she decided to freeze her embryos. Uh, and about six weeks later, she tried another psych. Now, in the meanwhile, our embryologist had, had some experience with this instrument. And uh, the excitement from the beautiful pictures had kind of given way to those beautiful pictures being a routine. And so when her cycle came around this time, suddenly she begged us not to put her embryos into the embryoscope, but let our embryology staff treat it routinely because in those weeks, they were no longer sure that they were getting equally good embryos. Now, as I sit here, we do not have results of the study and I have no idea what those results will be. Uh, but it seems obvious already from the existing literature and our early experience uh, in the study suggests that that we are not going to get better pregnancy rates because of use of the embryoscope.